Looking for hair removal tools that not only deliver smooth results, but also empower you with a sense of complete control? Enter Conair Girl Bomb, your secret weapons for smooth, sleek results made just for women. From the ultimate Girl Bomb grip and professional grade blades, you don't have to compromise and settle for less. Conair Girl Bomb equips you with the precision and power previously reserved for men's grooming tools. So take your hair removal routine to the next level with Conair Girl Bomb. Available at conairgirlbomb.com or a retailer near you. For 25 years, Brightview Senior Living has been dedicated to creating an award winning company culture so residents and families receive best in class services. Across our 50 communities, Brightview Associates help deliver peace of mind, safety, security, transportation, daily programs, delicious food, and high-quality care if needed. Discover how our vibrant senior living communities can help you live your best life. Visit brightviewseniorliving.com to learn more. Equal housing opportunity. In a world where fossil fuel companies are terrified of school children. Where world leaders are ignoring climate science. Bing, bing, bong, bong. And nature is recreating doomsday movie plots. What will happen next? It's up to you. Listen to the Outrage and Optimism podcast. The Elevation with Stephen Furtick podcast was created with you in mind. This is a podcast for those feeling discouraged or needing guidance from God. Together in this podcast, we'll dive deep into scripture, uncover the powerful truths that will help you rise above your limitations and embrace your full potential. We're here to equip you with the tools you need to conquer life's challenges. Listen to Elevation with Stephen Furtick every Sunday and Friday on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Hello. From Wonder Media Network, I'm Jenny Kaplan, and this is Womanica. Historically, women have been told to make themselves smaller, to diminish themselves. Some have used that idea to their advantage, disappearing into new identities. For others, a disappearance was the end to their stories, but the beginning of a new chapter of their legacy. This month, we're telling the stories of these women. We're talking about disappearing acts. It's September 4th, 2017, and a woman sits in her office at Genesis, Beijing, a 22-story building made of metal and glass. It overlooks a river and the rest of the Chinese capital. On that September day, she might negotiate billion-dollar deals, have lunches with influential politicians, or think about what to do with her son that weekend. Little does she know that after she leaves her office, she won't be seen in public again for years. Let's talk about Duan Weihong, also known as Whitney Duan. Whitney's life started with much humbler means. She was born the same year that Mao launched the Cultural Revolution, an attempt to purify China from capitalist pursuits. And as a child in the late 1960s, Whitney and her family lived in a tiny town in Shandong province. When she was a teenager, Whitney took the entrance exam so she could pursue a higher education. But she failed the test. This failure shut the door to better career opportunities. That said, she worked hard to pry the door back open. Whitney's mother then signed her up for automobile trade school. Instead of getting under cars, Whitney hunched over her books and dedicated nights and weekends studying to retake the exam. Twelve months flipped by on the calendar. And this time, Whitney passed the exam. She attended Nanjing Polytechnic Institute and graduated at the top of her class. She became the executive assistant to the university president and watched him network, balance relationships, and negotiate with influential officers and politicians. She learned how to become a chameleon, how to charm political influencers, and foster strategic relationships. In 1996, Whitney began building her own real estate development company called Great Ocean. By this point, the Communist Party had loosened its grip on capitalism. The country was in an economic boom and looked like the next great superpower. But doing business in communist China was still difficult. The Chinese Communist Party owns most of the land in China. So in order to build anything, it helps to find officials who have a stake in the project. They can help cut the red tape around the tedious and sometimes crooked bureaucratic process. 
and Whitney excelled at whining and dining government officials who offered to cut corners as long as they got a cut of her profits. Her business thrived. Whitney's success rose as high and grand as the building she was funding. In 2002, she moved to where the big players live, Beijing. She quickly started making friends with city officials and soon married her husband, Desmond Shum, who was a savvy businessman. Together, they got involved in a number of ambitious and lucrative projects like an airport cargo terminal and a luxury hotel. Whitney became a billionaire. After the couple had a son, it seemed like she had everything she could have ever dreamed of and more. As Whitney amassed wealth, so too did her political connections. The family of the premier of China at the time was said to have made $2.7 billion during his time in office. And when the New York Times investigated his finances, Whitney was named as a central figure. Whitney also got involved in politics more directly, funding and managing campaigns for government officials. But Whitney's success wouldn't last for long. The political tide was turning and a new leader stepped in. In 2012, Xi Jinping became the party leader and immediately began an anti-corruption campaign. He removed many long-standing government officials and replaced them with people who were loyal to him. Somehow Whitney got through this period mostly unscathed. But she now had a target on her. Desmond eventually suggested they leave the country and move their business abroad. But Whitney didn't want to lose all the years of growth and relationships she'd built. She pushed back, and the couple divorced. After one term of Xi Jinping's presidency, the Communist Party proposed a bill to remove the two-term limit. This made it easy for him to stay in power until he decided to step down. It was terrible news for Whitney. She'd been managing a political campaign for an official who was vying for the top seat in the next election. Whitney had met with him in tea houses and strategized how he could win. But with a party leader who had no interest in leaving, anyone who had political aspirations against him were marked. This time, she couldn't get away scot-free. In 2017, Whitney and her housekeeper suddenly disappeared. Whitney wasn't seen again for years. Her ex-husband and son had previously moved to the UK. There was no sign of Whitney for four years. Until her ex-husband decided to publish a tell-all memoir about doing business in communist China called Red Roulette. It was only when news of the book reached China that Whitney resurfaced. According to Desmond, Whitney said she was now on temporary release and could be detained at any time. In two phone calls, she urged him to not go through with the publication. Desmond told NPR she used the Chinese warning. The ones who oppose the state will see no good ending. Desmond Shum published the book anyway. Whitney was reportedly seen twice in 2023, once visiting a nursing home and once attending a seminar about rural regeneration. Her current status and whereabouts are unknown. Whitney is one of a number of Chinese billionaires who've recently disappeared. All month, we're talking about disappearing acts. For more information, find us on Facebook and Instagram at Womanica Podcast. Special thanks to Liz Kaplan, my favorite sister and co-creator. We'll be back tomorrow with a brand new theme. Talk to you then. Looking for hair removal tools that not only deliver smooth results, but also empower you with a sense of complete control? Enter Conair Girl Bomb, your secret weapons for smooth, sleek results made just for women. From the ultimate Girl Bomb grip and professional grade blades, you don't have to compromise and settle for less. Conair Girl Bomb equips you with the precision and power previously reserved for men's grooming tools. So take your hair removal routine to the next level with Conair Girl Bomb. Available at conairgirlbomb.com or a retailer near you. For 25 years, Brightview Senior Living has been dedicated to creating an award-winning company culture so residents and families receive best-in-class services. Across our 50 communities, Brightview Associates help deliver peace of mind, safety, security, transportation, daily programs, delicious food, and high-quality care if needed. Discover how our vibrant senior living communities can help you live your best life. 
Visit brightviewseniorliving.com to learn more. Equal housing opportunity. Does money stress you out? Let Facet flip your financial chaos into clarity. We feel way more confident and secure in our finances. And with that comes a sense of freedom. Financial planning from Facet is here to help you improve your life today, tomorrow, and every day after that. Facet was really the place where we saw all of the tools and the people coming together. Visit Facet.com, F-A-C-E-T.com to learn more. This ad is sponsored by Facet. Facet Wealth is an SEC-registered investment advisor. This is not an offer to buy or sell securities, nor is it investment, legal, or tax advice. These testimonials are from current Facet members who are not compensated. All opinions are their own and not a guarantee of a similar outcome. In a world where fossil fuel companies are terrified of school children. Where world leaders are ignoring climate science. Bing, bing, bong, bong. And nature is recreating doomsday movie plots. What will happen next? It's up to you. Listen to the Outrage and Optimism podcast.